Hi everyone, this is Shivani here. Welcome to my channel Shivani Creations. My today's project is how to create this cute quilt Raj and Simran from Dilwale Dulaniya Le Chayenge. This is very popular movie in Bollywood, India and these are the most favorite characters of film industry Raj and Simran. I have tried to recreate the model using paper quilling strips so let's get started for this first I'm starting with Simran so I'm taking five strips to create the face and here I'm taking brown colored 3 mm strips just make a tight coil first and pinch in the bottom little bit in the same way I have created one more tight coil using 5 strips of peach color and then I am just opening it and making a dome using my quilling mold add glue inside both the domes and connect with each other So face is ready, allow it to dry. Then here I am taking one more tight coil which is made using 7 strips of 3mm peach color and again I am opening it using my quilling mold little bit. Add a little glue inside this. We don't need to open it very much because this is the upper part of the body and these two domes for the lower body. This dome is made using 7 strips of 3mm and this dome is made using 7 strips of 5mm green color and the height of the bigger dome is 2 cm and the smaller dome is 1 cm I have just tabbed in the center using the cap of my glue bottle on both the domes now I am just connecting these domes with each other like this then here I'm taking half strip of peach color I have just cut my 3 mm strip from the center to create the thin strip and I'm randomly making one small ring using my fingers so it will be the neck I'm attaching neck like this and on top of this I will add face like this then I'm starting with the sleeves for this I'm taking one strip of 5 mm green color and making one cone just using my pencil to create the cone tap bottom little bit and one hand will be straight and other hand will be folded like this so for each hand we will be needed two cones I am just adding glue inside this cone and in the same way I have created one more cone of same height so I am just connecting the cone in L shape like this so it will look like a folded hand Okay, so one hand will be straight and one will be folded then taking back my doll add little glue in the bottom and connect with the green color paper then I'm starting with the palm for this I'm taking one and half strip of peach color 3 mm and making one tight teardrop shape I have already connected the palm with the straight hand 
and for the folded hand i am not connecting it right now i will do it later when i will connect the hands with the body okay now to close this opened coil from back side i am just adding this green color tight coil which is made using one strip of 3 mm green color just for the finishing look okay so the hands are ready now here i have created some more cones for the leg these two cones are made using two strips of 5 mm green color and this is made using two strips of 5 mm green color the height of these small cones are 4 cm each so since i need to create one folded leg that's why i'm joining two cones together like this and the height of the other cone is 7 cm so it will be the straight leg i like to dry now i'm just adding one strip here in the center part for the finishing look and then i am just going to trim the excess paper from the bottom and then attach both the legs hold it for some time and allow it to dry then here i have taken one small paper strip this is a designer paper and i have cut in such a way that it should look like a jacket a small jacket in the same way i have added on another side so just sticking it using glue then i am taking one small green color 5 mm strip adding one golden strip in the bottom in the same way i have created some more then i'm just joining these strips like this and creating a fan kind of shape so it will work like a plates for her dress So it's done. Now I'm adding one more golden paper strip at the end. And according to the height of my doll, I'm just trimming the excess paper. Then I'm taking this designer green color paper and I'm going to wrap it around my doll to create her skirt. And then adding my plated strip pattern with the skirt in the front like this so it's done i have added one golden strip around this green paper as well then i am going to show you how to create shoes so this tight coil is made using two strips of golden color 3 mm i have just created one tight leaf shape and adding one small tight coil on the front which is made using one fourth strip of 3 mm golden color so the juti or shoe are ready and i am just connecting the shoes with the legs like this then i'm taking green color 10 mm strip and wrapping it around the waist area i have added a golden strip in the bottom and created two cuts on both the sides so that it will look like a small kurti
and then I am attaching hands and also I will add the palm So I have connected the palm here little folded and then here I am taking one more designer paper strip and adding it through the shoulder on back side to cover her shoulder part this portion was little tricky so I have tried to uh, give a look of jacket to it you can also use any ready-made small dolls jacket and directly put it here now I'm starting with the dupatta so here I'm taking one fourth strip of 5 mm green color and I will start adhering it with the head like this all around the back side so just add glue one by one and start adhering these strips like this Just complete it so after adding dupatta it will look like this I have also decorated it using some stones and added golden strip around it it's looking fabulous now I'm showing you how to create ears nose so I'm taking one fourth strip of 3 mm peach color I just cut my 3 mm strip from center to make a thin strip you can also use 2 mm strips just make a loose coil and then create a small teardrop shape in the same way I have created one more so ears are ready and for the nose I took one eighth strip of peach color so I have already added ears and nose and for the eyes I took bindi for eyebrows I have used my black pen and lips are made using red color paper and then I added some jewelry using stones and ball chains for the earring I took golden strip and created small domes for Jhumka and I have added the boundary or border on the jacket using my yellow color 3d outliner so a cute Simran is ready and she is really looking pretty now it's time to make our Raj so I have prepared the face just like we created for the Simran using five strips and this big dome is made using 12 strips of white color 5 mm and the height of this dome is 5.5 centimeters so here I'm going to show you one trick if you want to increase the size of dome how you can do it and if you pull this dome little bit more it can ruin your strips so to extend this I have created this dome which is made using six strips of five mm white color I have just created one ring first and the diameter of this ring should be little lesser than your dome diameter so that it can fit perfectly inside this so you just need to create one ring first and open it to create dome now the total height of this cone dome is 7 cm so see by attaching the lower dome I have increased the height without any more efforts so I'm just going to connect both the domes then I'm adding the neck and face like this then here I have prepared this jacket using red color designer paper I just cut it in a shirt pattern and I'm just cutting the front part using my scissor and going to connect it like this
hold it for some time and allow it to dry here i have decorated the bottom of jacket using golden strips and also added small white triangle for collar now i cut two triangles on both the sides to give real kurta look and now i'm going to connect this with the white paper allow it to dry then i am starting with the shoes so here i am taking one strip of peach color 3 mm just make a tight teardrop shape then i am taking one strip of golden color 3 mm and making one malaysian flower petal Just connect your tight tear drop inside this. Wrap this whole thing using golden strip, and your juti is ready. Also, I have created one cone using three strips of white color 5 mm for the legs. So I am just going to connect this cone with the shoe like this. In the same way, I have created one more. The height of the cone is four centimeters. Now, taking back the doll, just cutting the excess paper from the bottom. and connecting the legs allow it to dry here to give a loose salwar look i am adding small white 5 mm strip like this so you can say dhoti or you can say salwar or pajama anything because the raj is wearing pathani suit so i have tried my best to create that look in the same way i have added on both the sides okay now i have created these hands using one and half strip of white color 5 mm for each cone so we need total four cones for both the hands and this cute mandolin is made using one piece of cardboard i have just added designer paper and decorated it using white gel pen very easy so i am just adding hands palm and mandolin also i have connected the palm and features are similar to the simran and hairs i have added brown color strips here and there so the raj is also ready he is looking very smart so a cute quilt simran and raj are ready and they are looking fabulous now here i am taking one circular base which is having 12 cm diameter i have just decorated it using designer paper so i am going to connect both the dolls on top of this you can decorate the edge of the circle using half cut pearls or any clay design so the very cute and beautiful 
Raj and Simran quilt model is ready. I'm sure you will try to do this very soon and in this way you can create any model of your choice. So my project is done for today. Hope you enjoyed my video. Please subscribe my channel for more interesting videos and please click on bell icon for the latest updates and notifications. I am waiting for your suggestions and comments. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Bye.